Well, the nine days are set to return as we close out the week and begin the weekend. And it is going to be another scorcher with some fire weather concerns as we get closer to Sunday and Monday. Hi, everybody. Meteorologist Matt Gray. And a mild night tonight for many areas. We'll only get down into the low 60s again around Spokane and Coeur d'Alene. A few more 50s on the board, but they'll be going away in the days to come. Lots of sunshine again as we head into Friday. And, uh, well, there you go. 90 in Spokane and Coeur d'Alene. 101 in the LC Valley and upper 90s across the Columbia Basin. And like I said, we are just getting started. It is going to be even hotter Saturday and Sunday before temperatures drop in uh, down on Monday as some cooler air rolls in. Now with that cooler air comes gusty winds. And after all of that heat and very low humidities, that means that we do have the potential for a weather alert day on Monday because of fire weather. Dry weather and high winds, never a great combination. And there are fire weather watches now in place across eastern Washington. Uh, for the central Washington basin, that starts on Sunday. For Spokane and the Palouse, that will start on Monday. So as you plan things out, keep that in mind. And hey, be safe out there as we head into Monday. We'll get a break from the hot weather on Tuesday into Wednesday, but we're right back into the 90s late next week.